how to customize exceptions with the do not disturb features on your Samsung Galaxy S8. So with the do not disturb features, boys, uh, once this feature is enabled, then your phones will uh, automatically mute all calls, alerts, and media. So uh, basically, um, your phone will uh, go into silent uh, totally. Now you can add exceptions to that, and I'll show you how. First, let's go back to your home screen by tapping on the home key. Or you can swipe down from the top here and go into settings. So tap on the settings icon. Now this will take you to the settings screen. Next, tap on sounds and vibration. From here, go down and tap on the do not disturb features. So you can tap on the switch to enable them. Or you can tap on the left hand side here to further customize it. So I'm going to enable do not disturb features. And you can see the symbol appears at the top. Now you can enable schedules. So if you tap on enable as schedules, this means that you can set what day and between uh, from what time to what time the features will turn on. And the end time is when the, f the features will be turned off. So let's say if you go to sleep between 10 p.m. and 7 a.m., then you want to um, enable do not disturb uh, from Monday uh, to Sunday. This is the default. So you can go in here and change it. Let's say during the workday from Monday to Friday. So I select Monday to Friday and I go back and I set my schedules and we'll start from 10 to 7 a.m. the next day. And during this time, uh, the do not disturb features will uh, turn on. And after 7 a.m., the do not disturb feature will be turned off automatically. Now you can allow exceptions. So tap on allow exceptions down here. And you can see here, you can say, okay, only alarms. Will be uh, will be working, or you can tap on the customize. So with uh, customize, uh, you can see the alarms will automatically be enabled. You can enable the repeat colors. So with repeat colors, if the caller is calling you twice or three times uh, within the 50 minutes, that means um, they will be allowed to uh, to call you, and the phone will uh, raise uh, a call a call alert. Uh, let's say if they have an emergency and they need to call you. Uh, immediately so you can uh, allow the repeat callers. Now you can also tap on calls form and this allows you to choose uh, which contacts can uh, call you even when the disturb feature is turned on. You can also allow exception uh, for messages so uh, again uh, tapping on that and will allow you to choose a contact and from the contact list you can select who can uh, text you uh, even when the disturb feature is turned on, you will get an alert from that uh, particular chosen person. And if you go down, you can see you can also enable uh, alerts from events and task alerts. So if you have an important uh, um, alert, you want to allow exception for that uh, event, you can turn on. And again, you got the reminder. So allow reminders uh, from a particular app, so you can tap on the switch. To allow reminders uh, as an exception, and you can also choose a priority app uh, notifications. So if you tap on that, you can go through the apps and uh, select uh, custom individual apps and which apps can raise an alert for your phone during the do not disturb feature is turned on. So you can see you can have a lot of exceptions in here, and it goes down to the calls, go down to the messages, event and task reminders. And you can even uh, select individual apps, uh, customize which app can uh, raise an alert uh, while the do not disturb feature is turned on. And that's it, that's how you can uh, um, set up uh, or customize the allow exceptions in the do not disturb features on the Samsung Galaxy S8. And finally, you can tap on the home key at the bottom to take you back to your home screen. Thank you for watching this video.